Are you overwhelmed by the amount of social media management platforms out there? Because so was I. You don't want to waste all of your time and money going through free trials, trying different schedulers, because I have done the work for you. Now we've all heard of Hootsuite, but is that really the best platform out there? Today, I'm comparing Hootsuite to a newer social media management tool on the market called Cloud Campaign that is designed specifically for social media agencies just like yours. Hey, my name is Mail, and I own a multi six figure social media agency and I now help social media managers do the same. If you're new here, make sure you grab my free roadmap to becoming a six figure social media manager in the description below. Now let's dive in. Hootsuite versus Cloud Campaign. Let's talk plans and pricing. Plans and pricing obviously is a big deal when it comes to choosing what social media management platform is right for you. So let's compare the two plans and the cost that comes with choosing between those two platforms. Now, starting out looking at Cloud Campaign, first thing that I noticed, obviously they offer a free trial, which is always great. We love free trials, even though you don't have to take a free trial because I am doing the work for you but it's always great to have a risk-free opportunity to try these schedulers for yourself. Now, looking at their pricing plans, they have three go-to plans from freelancer to agency. Now, they offer monthly plans as well as annual plans, but the first thing that I notice is $41 a month as a freelancer is actually very budget friendly. I've gone through many tools in my social media management career and social media schedulers are usually the biggest cost. And so for the $41 as a freelancer, you get one brand workspace, which includes seven social accounts for clients. You get unlimited users, which is pretty rare. I haven't really seen that before, but it does include a lot for someone that's just starting out and someone that's freelancing. Now, for someone a little bit more advanced, maybe like yourself, you probably need more. So if we look at the studio plan, which is actually their most popular plan, you we are talking $190 a month, and you get over five brand workspaces. So one thing I noticed, they also have unlimited users and unlimited social accounts, which again is super rare. I don't see this a lot. Usually there's a lot of add-on costs that schedulers tell you that, yeah, you can have X accounts, but you need to pay extra, right? Now they don't do that. So there's no hidden fees. They're very clear about what's included. So if we go down here, you will get a bigger overview of exactly what's included. And even their paid social reporting is free. Again, something that you don't see for all plans and the things that they don't charge for. Additional users, unlimited scheduling. And that's something I often see as well, where there's limited scheduling that platforms allow. And diving deeper into the comparison here, you can see exactly what's included and what isn't included. Included. So the freelancer plan is great for someone that's starting out, has a few social accounts, just to have a software that really supports them. I would recommend that. But if you're a bit more advanced and you have several clients on your roster, I would recommend the studio plan here because it seems like a no brainer with unlimited users and unlimited social accounts. Now let's take a look at Hootsuite and their plans and pricing. So what we see here is that they actually only have two plans, two go-to plans. Now, the first thing I notice is that they start at $99 a month, which is almost double the price of Cloud Campaign. And something else I notice is they only offer one user. This is very restrictive, especially if you wanna get clients into the account, do the approval. One user is likely not enough. Another thing they have is they offer 10 social accounts, but if you wanted more accounts, this is not, it doesn't seem to be an option. So here the professional start up, starting plan is $99, 10 accounts, only one users, and additional users is not an option here. You would have to upgrade all the way till the enterprise, which is very interesting. They offer unlimited posts, so that is a good thing but it is very limited and cost-wise, 
Cloud Campaign is definitely winning here. So while Cloud Campaign is very transparent about their pricing, which I love because if you do need more workspaces, that is a possibility for a small fee. Now looking at Hootsuite, this isn't even a possibility with them. You're limited to 10 social accounts only, which honestly worries me because obviously you are looking to scale your social media business fast. Cloud Campaign versus Hootsuite, platforms and scheduling. Of course, the main objective for you to invest into a social media management platform is so that you can get the support to schedule and plan content across all of your clients' social media platforms. So something I looked into is what platforms they support in their scheduling tool. And looking at Hootsuite, they offer all major platforms, which is great. They offer Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, LinkedIn, and even YouTube as well as Pinterest. So they do cover all platforms, but when I looked at Cloud Campaign, what I noticed is they offer all major platforms as well. But on top of that, they also included Google My Business. Google My Business profiles have become more and more popular and important, especially for local brick and mortar businesses to be found on Google. Like being able to schedule out content so that your Google My Business profiles up to date can be extremely important for those that drive traffic to their website from Google. So it's very interesting that they offer this option because not many platforms do. Now, another thing that I loved about Cloud Campaign and their platforms is that let's say you have a social media platform like Lemonade that is not as popular for people to use. And so social media schedulers don't always use these platforms or allow you to schedule to those. What Cloud Campaign has is a feature when you can send a push notification to your phone so that you can publish the content to any platform, such as a Lemonade or whichever platform your client might be on that is not as typical or mainstream social media. So I honestly think that is a big game changer for social media management platforms to include things like Google My Business and being able to schedule out content so that you can publish it anywhere at any time. So Cloud Campaign definitely wins here since Hootsuite is limited to only the mainstream social media platforms. Cloud Campaign versus Hootsuite social media analytics. Now social media insights and analytics is extremely important for social media managers. So so that they can report back to their clients on performance, ROI, and showcase how their work is doing. So this is one of the first things I always look into when I check out social media management platforms. Now I did a 14 day free trial with Cloud Campaign, and so I got to see what their analytics looked like. And one of my favorite features was actually their analytics reporting. So one thing they have is that you can completely customize, but create an interactive analytics link for clients so that they can access your analytics dashboard at any time. This is obviously super convenient because first of all, you don't have to create anything manually, but secondly, it's interactive and allows clients to access analytics at any time. Now, the fact that Cloud Campaign offers unlimited users, right? As we saw in the plans and pricing, allows you to create an account, a user account for any of your clients so that they can access their analytics board, okay, dashboard. This is extremely game-changing because again, the Hootsuite starting plan for $99 only included one user and multiple users isn't available until you're on an enterprise plan and get a custom plan for your business. Absolutely love the interactive reporting from Cloud Campaign that makes a huge difference for you as a social media manager so that you can prove your value and ROI to clients. I also did a free trial with Hootsuite and here are some of the analytics and what that looks like. One thing I did like is that you can completely customize the analytics dashboard as well and ex export it as a PDF. But the thing is you cannot create an interactive report for clients. Another thing that concerns me is that it feels rather overwhelming as um, here you can see that you can remove, customize, you can 
customize the entire board to the metrics that are important for your clients, but it feels like quite a bit of work. So let's say I don't need post links. I delete this tile and I can move these around, right? Let's say I don't, I don't need calls to track from Instagram. I will delete this tile as well. I can change this into a different form, delete it. So I don't need that, but it feels rather scattered and it seems to have quite a bit of a learning curve. I'm not a huge fan of the dashboard and what it looks like because the whole point for you is to have a social media management platform that makes reporting easy, right? You want it to do the work for you rather than add more work onto your plate because then you might as well track the insights manually. Now, if you want to see exactly what I thought of my 14 day trial with clown campaign, then check out this honest review I did in this other video where I dive deeper into cloud campaign on its own. Cloud campaign versus Hootsuite approval process. Now, another important part of you doing social media management work for clients is getting content approved, right? And giving your client the ability to give feedback and approve content before it goes live. Now, you want this process to be as seamless as possible because it can get complicated when doing a back and forth. So inside of social media schedulers, you often find approval process. So when I looked at Cloud Campaign, they are actually doing an amazing job at the approval process because they allow you to have an internal review with your own team as well as an external approval process with the client. I absolutely love this because this is exactly how we do it with my agency where there's a back and forth between me and the social media managers before it goes over to the client. And of course you don't always want the client to see the back and forth between the team members. So this keeps the two very separate and very seamless for your client to approve content. So I absolutely absolutely love their process here. I think it's very clean, seamless, and easy for clients to access their approval dashboard, which again can be shared through a simple link with them so that they can approve content before it goes live. Even better is that as soon as a client hits approve, it actually gets scheduled into the cloud campaign social media scheduler so that you no longer have to worry about it and content doesn't go live unless it is approved. Now, looking at Hootsuite, I took a look and had a hard time finding their approval process. Now, the reason why is because I was on their starter plan and they do not offer a single approval process on their starting plan. Now, unfortunately, I didn't want to spend $250 to be able to see what their approval process looked like. So I think this is a huge bummer and a huge downside of Hootsuite because there is simply no approval process on their starting plan. Approval process is super important. So a big thumbs up and points for cloud campaign here. Now, if you want to check it out for yourself, get their free trial, but even include a discount on your cloud campaign subscription, then make sure you check out the link that I'll drop in the description below and use code mil 15 for a 15% discount. Now to wrap up my comparison video between Hootsuite versus cloud campaign, here are some of my final insights and thoughts. Cloud campaign, obviously, offers a lot more for the price that you pay. There's a lot more bang for your buck versus Hootsuite that is very limited in the features that they offer. And again, they really come at a price. There is no hidden cost when it comes to cloud campaign and they really have created this social media management platform with the social media manager you in mind. So I highly recommend their platform over an expensive yet popular platform like Hootsuite. Now, actually one of my favorite features that cloud campaign also offers that I didn't dive into today is their white label feature. So you can actually make money using cloud campaign and white label their platform for your clients, but put it into your own branding, which is again, a feature I haven't seen anywhere else. And you can apply this white labeling feature to make more money in your business by offering do it yourself services, strategy services, or simply just content planning for a client so that you can sell the scheduler along with your services and go into the tool and help them out along the way. Now, if you found this video helpful, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Let me know what social media management platform you are currently using and give Cloud Campaign a try after seeing this comparison video. Make sure you subscribe so that I don't miss you in next week's video.